testimony later. I thank and I praise God for even seeing you another day, another yes, time. Yes. I say that to the glory of God because recently, one night I had a heart attack, or should I say I was having a heart attack in my sleep. I could hear the doctors on the radio and on the TV saying that you could cut off a heart attack by taking an aspirin right away. So I got up out of the bed, I took an aspirin. I went back to bed, I could feel a discomfort. Having had a heart attack in 2006, I could distinguish the exact symptoms. Wow. And I felt the discomfort while I was laying there in the bed. Mm -hmm. And I asked the Lord, I said, Lord, you know what this is, just as well as I do. No sooner than I said it, he removed the discomfort. I don't know when or what time I fell asleep, but I did. I woke up the next day feeling fine. But that wasn't, that wasn't the end of my dilemma. I was sitting up in service over at Temple Number One just a couple of weeks ago, and the enemy attacked my body again. Oh, Jesus. I'm sitting there in service having a heart attack. But the Holy Ghost! The Holy Ghost told me, he said, place your hand over your heart. Wow. Mm. No sooner did I did that. God mm. bless my body right there in the middle of the So he said, get up and testify. I can only tell you what God has done for me. He delivered me from a heart attack. Quite recently. And I thank and I praise him every day of my life. Yes. Before I put my feet on the floor. Yes, Lord. It's Lord, I thank you. And I thank him right now. Yes, Even Lord. while I'm standing here, yes, I'm thanking him. Because I can be dead yes. and gone. Yes. Lord, I thank you. that we're talking about how the Lord delivered them a sinus problems, as you can tell by the way that I sound. I'm having problems breathing, but I believe in God that if it's by his will, I'll be through, I will, it, this problem will leave me this very night. In the name of Jesus. Pray much for me. Oh, 